I am not a financial advisor. Do not take any of this as financial advice. These are my own speculative opinions and should be taken as entertainment. <clears throat> okay, so ICO review, Era Cube. There will be a link down there if you want to check into Era Cube, ICO. Okay, so this one's got a 40% discount right now and they're two cents each. And they're 40% until they reach the pre-ICO hard cap, cap of one million. So they're going to sell a million dollars worth um, in the pre-ICO. So we're in the pre-ICO stage and it's 40% bonus and then it gets less and less bonus as you go along. So let me see if I'm on. If I've got an audience here. I'm not probably, let's just see if I'm on. I'm live, yes. Nobody here yet though. Okay, so I'm just going to continue on here. Okay, so this thing is really kind of cool. This is an example here of the, the thing. They're these cubes and they're run by robots. That's, they're, they're intending to run these by robots. So this is the, um, the, the one page white paper and then they have a full white paper. This is the full one. It's a huge, long white paper. They thought this whole thing out. Here's the um, ERC. 20 token it's 1.5 billion brett that's the name of it brett tokens here's their github here okay so ericube is the world's first global decentralized ecosystem providing a direct real life connection between e-commerce and consumers you can share in the success of this revolutionary blockchain based business by joining us as an investor <clears throat> we'll check it out there's the, the video is down further down too so 40% bonus um, Eric cube has developed the world's first robo pop-up chain of stores so they're rated they're rated at some ICO places okay robot powered retail Eric cube is a robotic powered pop-up store solving the product visibility problems faced by online retailers <clears throat> while maintaining the advantages of, of online retail and delivering unparalleled consumer insights. The best of both, both worlds, consumers get to see and try out the product before they buy, and merchants have an efficient way of showcasing their products in a contemporary environment in high footfall locations around the world, like in shopping malls and airports. One stop solution to put the product on the Eric Cube shelves in the leading shopping centers across the world. Simplicity is at the heart of the Eric Cube concept. For merchants, it's a straightforward process of renting a shelf and sending us the products. We will then take care of all the marketing sales and transactions. For consumers, the Eric Cube is a giant, cool looking interactive vending machine. You simply browse the products and purchase using a credit card or debit card and your products is dispensed to you immediately check out our video to find more plus it's going to take the eric cube cryptocurrency which is going to give you a 30 percent discount so if you use the the, the 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 tokens it says right here paying for goods bought in eric cube using brett tokens guarantees a discount of 30 percent so if you use a credit card it's regular price if you use the eric cube tokens you get a discount. Capitalizing the ecosystem. Brett tokens are the fuel of the ecosystem and are the means for channeling profit back into the business. 100% of profit will be returned into the business via monthly token buybacks. Buyback tokens will be distributed between token holders and active users. For more info, okay, so the white paper. Okay, so here's here's um, their, their solidity 4.11 if you want to check that out and here's like I showed you already the contract in the, the github okay let's check out the token economics quickly so monetization comes through a share of the company's revenue stream to the token holder <clears throat> token liquidity on the crypto exchange is supported by the merchants who buy Eric Cube tokens to pay for the shelf space, thus providing demand for the tokens. So they have to, the, the people 
the merchants who want to put their stuff up, they have to um, buy tokens to, to rent the shop space. <clears throat> and they've already got some some people that have agreed to put these things into their you know their shopping malls or wherever their property put it on their property so let's take a look further let's go back to the to the web page main web page here what did we miss back here okay so token sales strategy the Eric cube ecosystem is built on open source technology and is a unique model that incentivizes all participants. Token bonus, 40% right now, until they get to the million dollar pre-sale hard cap, and then it goes on to the next level. So the next bonus level is 20%, then 10%, then 5%, and then no bonus. So, there's a total of 1.5 billion. The exact number of tokens generated depends on the amount of funds contributed. No token creation, minting or mining after the ICO is over. Token info, so we saw that. <clears throat> Shopping centers, Eric Cube provides a fast track direct channel for the the thousands of smaller brands currently only available online by showcasing a constantly updated range of exciting new products shopping centers can bring the best of the online retail quite literally within touching distance of the consumer online merchants by removing the numerous layers of bureaucracy and red tape associated with gaining a listing in a traditional brick and mortar retailer Ericube provides a fast, easy, and cost-effective way for merchants to get their products into high footfall retail environments. Ericube creates a decentralized retail ecosystem that will be used by a broad audience. Here's a picture of a, there's a video here of um, a robot that, that's working, taking things off shelves. The ecosystem will thr thrive from a flow of consumers looking to buy the latest products at low prices. And with suppliers keen to boost their sales by reaching these consumers directly and bypassing intermediaries. Benefits. Ericube is developing a breakthrough solution. Solution addressing these issues by putting blockchain-driven technology at the core of the retail 3.0 and the Internet of Things. So... Over 100 global brands are looking to join the Ericube ecosystem. We have partnered with leading retail real estate, with leading real estate companies, landlords, and shopping centers, with a collective annual turnover more than six billion. These companies are at the cutting edge of bricks and mortar retail and are constantly striving to find new and innovative ways to connect with their customers and pro provide them with the products <clears throat> that they want. With these organizations <clears throat> behind the Ericube project, we have a solid platform for growth. Core team members, the Ericube team have over 10 years experience in omni-channel retail op operation, operations. Since 2008, they have connected with over 4,000 stores across the, uh, across the globe. So here's the founder and CEO, Costa Dubinin. As his title suggests, Costa Dubinin loves the challenges that come with, come with launching new companies to success. For more than 10 years, he has worked as an entrepreneur, building and leading teams into previously uncharted territory. He founded AK Techno, a security system integrator, global satellites technology, a satellite and internet connectivity venture, and founded and raised substantial capital for Countbox, a retail and analytics de developer. So here's the rest of the team. Andrei Stru Strukov is a leading technology strategist and innovator with a reputation for building cutting edge technology solutions that drive exponential growth. So he's got lots of experience. we got lots of experience on this team, senior backend developer, senior blockchain developer, they got one already. Legal advisor, they got all kinds of great advisors here. 
You can check their LinkedIn. They've got LinkedIn, all of them. You can check out Amit's video interview. Why don't we take a look here? Now, um, if the sound might not be very well, very good. If you want to check check out the website, you can. There'll be a link down there if you want to look at the website yourself. But this might not be that great sound. All right. Okay. Sorry about that. <laughs> okay, I mean, so I uh, glad to uh, have you today on uh, our interview. At the, we regularly do interviews in Aircube of our advisors, and we still going through the first round of the initial interviews. Uh, we're gonna have uh, a few more in our series coming. Uh, however, I was going to ask you uh, pretty much. Just uh, introduce yourself, and I will have a few questions. Okay. Uh, so my name is Amit uh, Dhamadeve. Um, yeah, I've been in the IT industry for about uh, 15 years, and I think it's a good role for about uh, 12, 12 plus role, uh, years. And, you know, I've been in the aquarium and museum space uh, all my IT career. Excellent, excellent. Why did you join the Aircube project? I joined the Aircube project because it didn't look uh, there was something really cool and current and, and uh, not not nobody else is doing something like that. Um, with with you know automation and, and analytics and you know everybody wants big data and analytics and, and how their customers are reacting to their uh, products, uh, you know, I uh, got the uh, retailers are getting that kind of information, which Aircube, I think, will, will solve that problem awesome. uh, in a time. Excellent. Uh, what inspired you to believe into the great success of the Aircube project? Why did you decide to join? Uh, I've been, uh, you know, following uh, um, the industry, you know, the robotic industry, and everybody else is out there. Uh, that's what everybody's heading to. And then, um, you know, looking at the the shopping world and stuff like that, it's kind of like taking a downward spiral, like it's going to put them all and stuff like that. Where I think if you fit in perfectly uh, to solve that, you know, gap between the uh, online, offline. Um, uh, shopping experience for, for people. Great. Um, what do you envision in the future for ARQ project? Where do you see uh, us in the future? I see, you know, this technology being used uh, for a lot of different things, not just for, for shopping, um, but, you know, uh, in, in store for doing, you know, inventory management and stuff like that. Uh, and, you know, it's like, uh, and then the since it's an uh, ease of implementing this uh, project is so easy, I see it being able, you know being able to scale this um, in any way direction possible. So you know I see like you know, a lot of great future for for this project. That's that's great. Uh, what do you think about the cryptocurrency and the cryptocurrency industry? Uh, you know. Cryptocurrency, I guess, you know, is that everybody is on the bandwagon right now. Uh, I think that industry is not going anywhere anytime soon. Uh, we're just going to have to, I guess, figure out, you know, since the government doesn't have a lot of control over it, then they're trying to figure out how to get control over it or something. So until they figure out what they're going to do um, with the cryptocurrencies, I think we're still going to see the fluctuations of, you know, it going up and down, but I think that the cryptocurrency itself is going to stick around and, and looks like you know it's going to be the future of currencies. Awesome. All right, Dami. This is uh, very insightful. Thank you so much for sharing your uh, vision and opinion. That's, uh, I think it's very useful. Um, thank you so much for your time. Sure. Thanks. Thank All right. You. Cheers. Bye. Okay, so he says it's going to be easy to, to start this thing up. So that was Emmett. <clears throat> and all their LinkedIn is there.
Eric Cube was founded in Dublin at the beginning of 2017. The progression of the established count box retail and analytics system led to the birth of a new project delivering a fully automated retail experience, Eric Cube. Hmm. So there you go. Let's take a look at the white paper. It's a really, really comprehensive white paper. It's long. They, they thought of lots, lots of stuff. And this thing is unique. It is unique. I'll give them that. Like nobody else is doing this. Okay, so. No human sales, only robots serve. 3D facial payment embedded. At least 14 digital signage screens. Product examples showcased by a perimeter. So this, this is a really comprehensive form of what we just went over on this 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 page here this is like just more detailed so you can put your brand here up to 2,000 items in stock only robots inside seamless payments try and touch 15 real estate companies from UK Ireland and Australia have already committed to host Eric cube at their properties okay Brett monthly activity function 100% of area cube net income will be set sent to smart contract for monthly buyback smart sorry buyback tokens will be distributed between token holders and active users depending on their activity so here's the contract that they're talking about the product's key features are full automation lean access to offline clientele Fast offline channel, innovative data capture solutions, customized shelf space, one-stop solution. <clears throat> so check out this white paper if you want to. Go over it with a fine-tooth comb. You can stop, just just pause it whenever you want and read what it says here. If you want to go into really fine detail into this, to just, just pause it whenever you want if you're watching this in the future. Eric Cube triple, triple win business model. Grow footfall, rent unleased space, bring in new audience. Con consumers benefits, try new digital products, enjoy new arrivals week. Every week, collect online purchases. <clears throat> online merchants, grow sales and cut returns, let customers try on the product. So I think what they do, they might be doing is is I don't know it's 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 really cool <laughs> extend international cost reach effectively even if you only have cash for one shelf per week get as rich data on clients as your website yeah it's really cool you get lots of data about your customers here's another example of the cube you could put sneakers in there sneakers are really expensive make a lot of money off <clears throat> make a lot of money off sneakers face ID payments 3d facial recognition demographic center sensor gender range emotions <laughs> over edge sensor dwell time per shelf height of visitors beacon ads hmm, nice you can find out all kinds of things about your customers Benefits for landlords, exhibition, real estate management company, stadium, all these types of places you can put it into. Even in a stadium, yeah. It's benefits for customers. New technology seekers, individuals, teenagers, tech engaged enthusiasts, release stage adopters. Those are the type of people that might want to look into it. Revenue streams, your brand here, can be customized to your product logo. <clears throat> Clients pay cash or with Brett tokens for shelf space rental. The cash then accumulates <clears throat> on the one end of our smart contract. Token holders willing to sell their Brett deposit them into the other end of the smart contract. The smart contract exchanges cash for tokens on a monthly basis. The number of tokens go, goes down as we burn 0.1% of Brett's from every transaction in the tokens. We also entitle our token holders 
with 100% of the chain net income through Brett net income and Brett through the token buyback program. Nice. It's really cool. Huh. Um, technology overview. So this is the example of the cube, the dimensions. You can just pause this whenever you want and read this. Pages and pages and pages. We're only halfway through here. They, they really thought of everything. And they say this is easy for them to do because they're already involved in this type of business stuff. So they want to have 300 plus cubes by 2020 or so. So here it is. They cost two cents each. Okay, it says they're 2.8 cents each based on Ethereum at being 850, while eight, Ethereum is 630 or so. And that comes out to two cents each. You can calculate it. So um, country restriction, everyone can participate. Mm, nice. Token lockup for team and founders, two years vesting with a 20% early withdrawal after six months, subject to board approval. All unsold tokens will be burnt. Token lockup for partner and advisor, advisors, two month vesting. Hmm. So that explains that. So here it's 40% discount, then 35, 30. So just pause it there whenever you want to take a look at any of these. If it's not blurry, when I do live, it kind of it's a little bit blurry because YouTube doesn't have it in HD. If this was like if I if I would have done this just on my computer and then uploaded it, it'd be high high definition. YouTube live, it's not really that great sometimes. Well, never is <clears throat> for um, definition. Hey, I got one person here. Thanks for coming. So here's this ICO that I'm going over. Hey, give me a thumbs up. I need a thumbs up. Anybody watching this in the future, I need a thumbs up. I'm all about the thumbs up. Here's some more stuff about the advisors. I need some thumbs ups, everybody. I need the thumbs ups. Brick and mortar customer analytics. It was, they just thought everything out. So these people are already willing to put stuff in their retail stores. Shopping center company, you know. So that's it. So if you want to participate in this um, pre sale, 40% discount, you can. Let's watch that video. This is the final video. We didn't watch it yet. It might not have very good sound, but. You can just check it out on the on the web page if it's, you want to check it out with better sound. There's a link down there in the description box. See if this works. Hello there. Do you have a product you wish the world to see and want to connect with customers and followers? Do you desire to go from being an unknown name to a popular brand? Would you like to expand beyond your current market and touch new markets cost-effectively? Say hello to the pop-up store experience. You are solving the problem of visibility by ensuring that everyone's talking about you and your product. It's like a big vending machine and a really cool life-size vending machine operated by robots. Here's how it works. We take your unique product and display it in our smart robotic pop-up store. Our smart pop-up stores can be situated literally anywhere, in a city park, beside the very busy street, in a shopping mall, or an airport. We place the pop-ups where maximum visibility is ensured. People walking by a smart pop-up store would be attracted by this really cool, invented product display, and that's why they'll buy in there. Digital signs stream near each product constantly display detailed information about the product and its price. Customers can purchase an item they love right away with the POS bank card reader included in the store. When payment is made, they turn to the dispensing point and get their item. 
voila! Like I said, just like a vending machine, a really cool vending machine, we'll not just give you sales, we'll have a lot of information about the shoppers, even those who only look at your products. We will have information about them that will help improve sales, things like dwell time at each single product, cross comparison, which products compare with each other from a customer perspective, heat map around the pop-up store, gender and age range of customers and people who just browsed and left, and anything else you would like to gather about your shoppers. Just let us know and we'll try to figure it out. Interested already? I know you are. So how much will this cost you? We practice what we preach and spread our own RAAS philosophy. We charge per purchase. You only pay per sale. It's perfect. Immediate ROI measurement. Fair payment model. No upfront investments. We guarantee that after two to three months, there will be increased profit. It's literally risk-free. We are getting your products in front of thousands of shoppers, helping you gather priceless customer information to help improve sales, and charging you only when a purchase is made. Let's do it together. Contact us now. Okay. So if you want to get involved in it, you can. It's open to everybody in the world. There's no restrictions. Let's check out Bitcoin is up to 8,818. Just hit the refresh button. 8,841. Okay, that's good. Let's check out the rest of the coins here. Bitcoin 8,831. Ethereum 630. Ripple 87, Bitcoin Cash 259, Bitcoin Cash is junk popping, EOS 1155, Litecoin 148.41, Cardano 28 cents, Stellar 36.8, IOTA 204, Neo 74.45, Monero 277.50, Dash 4. 63.47 Tron 5.3 cents NEM 38.6 VChain 388 Ethereum Classic 1921 Qtum 2034 Omisco 15.41 Binance Coin 12.97 Icon 3.51 Lisk 11.63 Bitcoin Gold 66.41, Bitcoin Private 52.87, Verge 6.9, Zcash 273.18, Nano 7.21, Populous 25.69, Item 93 cents, <clears throat> Bitcoin 48 one hundredths of a cent, Steam 306, Silica. 10 cents, bit shares 26.4 cents, one chain 644. Oh, nice. Bitcoin Diamond 446, Sia Coin 1.9, Dogecoin half a cent, Maker 934, Stratus 582, Digix Dale, DAO 280, 81, Eternity. 235, Archain 151, Aeon 404, Waves 524, Status 15 cents, 0x 99 cents, Golem 61, Ontology 411, Decred 6448, Augur 4022, <clears throat> Loop ring 75 cents, basic attention 42 cents, iOS token 5 cents, Komodo 392, Walton chain 1296, Arter 39, Digibyte 3.4, Arc 3.8, HShare 7.95, Denticoin. <laughs> Not very much for Denticoin. One tenth of a cent. KuCoin shares 416. Dragon Chain 132. PIVX 551. Mithril 98 cents. Elf 16. Centrality 41 and a half. 
Syscoin 51, Veritasium 133, Substratum 70 cents, Quash 76 cents, Cryptonex 592, Gas 2613, Factum 2915, Pundex 46 hundredths of a cent, Monacoin $4. Monacoin is the first ever Japanese cryptocurrency coin. <clears throat> Mixin 560, Kyber Network 172, Ethos 299, Redcoin 78 one hundredths of a cent, Storm 5.5 cents, Lastos 44.33, Lastos, Lastos, what's Lastos? <clears throat> So Elastos has been out since February. It's got a $224 million market cap. Look at this, it's only 5 million supply for 44 bucks. Total supply 33 million. But what is it? Like that's not very many tokens. 5 million tokens, that's a low supply. ELA login page, Elastos project. Let me see if I'm on. Maybe I'm not even on. No, I'm on. Okay, it should come on any second. Smart Web is a web of apps and dApps. We are creating an operating system for the Smart Web. Chen Rong, founder of Elastos. Check out their white paper. Smart web powered by blockchain description. This document, okay, that's fine. Let's just find what Elastos aims to create a new kind of internet powered by blockchain technology. On this new internet, people will be able to grow to own digital assets and generate wealth from them. Today, there's a seemingly infinite supply of digital books, movies, music, and games, but people do not necessarily own their own digital property. You can purchase a digital book, for example, but you can't sell it to anyone else. So do you really own it? Elastos wants to make digital assets scarce, identifiable, and tradable. Property rights pave the way for wealth creation, and Elastos intends to build a new World Wide Web that respects those rights. Hmm. The goal is to create an internet that allows users to access articles, movies, games directly without going through a media player, or another platform intermediary, Elastos will use blockchain technology to issue IDs for digital content, making it possible to know who owns which digital asset. On the Elos internet, filmmakers will know how many times their movies were viewed. The combination of Elastos and blockchain technology lays the foundation for a trustworthy and secure internet of wealth. Elast Elastos will be a platform for decentralized applications, dApps, that runs on a peer-to-peer -peer network with no centralized control. Nice. People can access these dApps via their mobile phones without changing their operating system. The old internet is a web of information. If you click URL, you get data. Elastos is creating a web of apps. When you click an URL, you get a code. The Elastos webs will be, will be a special economic zone where Elastos tokens function as the base currency. Good. So that's what it is. Let's check out the telegram. Sixteen thousand members. So it's forty four bucks, five million supply, total supply thirty three million. Hmm.
That's where you can buy it. Am I gonna buy it? No. <laughs> no. Okay, so give me a thumbs up. I need some thumbs ups. I'm all about the thumbs ups. If you haven't subscribed, subscribe, hit that notification bell if you haven't hit it already, and I want everybody to have a super day.